So, hey guys, Chauzy here. Today I got one new team for you against uh, Parking Avengers Maha. As you see, I'm starting to get higher level. This is going to be level 130. So let's jump into it. This time I'm going to do my first team with ISO as friend captain. It looks like this. And from now on, with the teams I make for Parking Avengers, I'm not just going to aim to beat level 100, but I'm trying to push the damage as high as you can, as I can, to help you guys be able to beat level 150 eventually. Like you might need some help from Sanji or Usopp, but hopefully you can do so much damage that you can pick Sanji or Usopp, or maybe even none of them. And yeah, I think the damage with this team is so high that you might not need any of them, potentially. It's a pretty dope team. Before we get into it, let's talk about some replacements and stuff. So, uh, Chopper needs to be Limbrick Expander for this team. Uh, one other option is a support here, which is the Carrot there. If you add this Carrot, just put her on, Us uh, on Chopper. Uh, other than that... We have Ace here, for example, for a chain boost for Luffy. Uh, instead of Ace, like there are some other options. You can just use the in-game filter now, super good. Just go to chain multiplayer boost, and you see that we have Uta, for example, which is really good. If you even have the Jinbei you can pick. I, Uta is better though, but Ace is even better to get a high chain. And another thing to note with this team is that Stussy needs to be fully level limit broken so you get her buffed special and yeah for this team uh, you just need to own sorrow like if you have him high super tandem is even better but this team works even with level one and even at level one you still get a lot of extra damage with the super tandem 1.5 times and of course the higher tandem you have the better so for me it's going to be really good and for this team, I'm not hitting with Luffy Yamato last, so you don't have to care about their mergers that much. And yeah, this team is pretty specific, so just follow turn by turn if you're not sure what to do. And final thing I'll speak about, uh, first I can p point out chopper support, not near at all. But I like to show Gunfall when I can, because it's a cool option for chopper. You get a free ore boost by 1.3 times every time you get paralysis or when you get paralysis once. So we're going to make use of that to get a bit of extra damage. Not required at all, just cool to show off. And we also use Victoria Punk. We're going to be using Grand Voyage all on stress where we're going to remove the barrier final stage with it. Which will let both Luffy Yamato and Iso hit for big damage here. That's the plan. Uh, let's jump into it. Uh, there's one thing I'm a bit nervous about here, uh, which is stage four, where I do need to hit a perfect, but of course we don't have easier perfect, so yeah, just need to play good. Let's just pick any ISO. And yeah, I was a bit worried with this team because, like, can I fulfill the super class requirement? But ISO has a very generous one you have several straw hats and stuff so yeah luffy being a condition is very helpful in general anyway enough talking let's get into it and yeah this is going to be very stally but as I said the focus here is not speed it's about doing the most damage stage five and yeah i'm going to use the same stress i've been doing for luffy yamato uh, I will say that I'm not saying that this is the optimal way to charge Luffy Yamato, but when you got a way that works, you stick to it because it can take attempts to try out other variants. Like Luffy Yamato is the hardest to charge in the game, really. So I'll just follow the strat I'm using. Uh, remember to only kill one opponent every turn just for the CD to work out properly. Don't really need to care too much about taking damage here. Oh, I swapped Yamato a bit early. 
Okay, so I restart the game. You can always do that if you make some error before you tap. This is usually why I don't do live recordings, but yeah, something to learn from me. The reason I don't want to be Yamato here is because if I take a hit, the CD is charged. I'm happy with the number my CD is right now. Uh, what I'll do now, like I, I'll get Nami Usopp ready. But other than that, I'll just tap with ISO because ISO's orb is going to change anyway. He's going to get a super block orb. And yeah, now we can take it easy a bit. Just swap one final time there. Otherwise, I'm just <laughs> tapping ISO until there's only one enemy left on stage two. And the damage taken here is pretty irrelevant, to be honest. Like, if you want to optimize, you can try and tap units who are going to attack you, but I doubt it matters much, really. Uh, before moving on, you have to remember to swap to Yamato, just to make the swaps line up properly. There we go, and we do one final ISO tap. And as you see by doing this, Chopper is ready. And Nami Usopp will also be ready once we get to the next stage. Like, my Nami Usopp is Slim Freak Expanded, but if they weren't, they will still be ready if you did this strat. So, no problems there. Uh, using Chopper Special here. Removes everything, very nice. Uh, swap to Luffy Yamato to get rid of the or to get an extra call affinity boost. And here I'm a bit unsure, like, I don't know if Apu's HP goes up a lot. So, like, you can have some different strats here. Like, right now, I know that I saw into Luffy kills, but you can probably build up the chain a bit. It should really matter. Like, I can hit with Chopper, Sorrow, Iso, and just build up even more damage. Can hit with everybody probably. And hitting a perfect with Iso is important, so we remove the damage reduction. And here we're going to target Queen, so that we don't get blindness, turn 2. Very easy to forget, so I recommend tapping Queen right away. And as you see, Gunfall, we get a bit of an ore boost. We also swap Nami Usopp, use their special, remove all of the paralysis. And also get a color affinity, so this is going to be big damage. We also swap Luffy Yamato. And now we just need to kill. We have a lot of big damage dealers here, but if you want to play optimally, you can start with the non-boosted stuff and work your way up there we go and as you see now we get the rainbow shield up and honestly we didn't take any damage i thought king was going to do some damage reduction or such so that's pretty neat we can super swap here it's perfectly fine we're not going to use their color thing at the final stage anyway it's subpar since it doesn't boost ISO. Stussy will handle that instead. So now we just need to hit one perfect with Nami Usopp or ISO. So start with Nami Usopp, I guess. Here we go. And very easy kill for Luffy Yamato. And yeah, we move on to final stage. This team is going to be big damage, as you will see. Okay, so first we used Stussy. Stussy gives us a call affinity, removes the special bind. And then we use ISO, so we get the one orbs. The order is pretty important here. After we use ISO, we can just use uh, ISO's super class so we don't forget it. Remove the death up. Then we use Sorrow. It's important that you use Sorrow before you swap Nami Usopp. Sora gives an attack boost and gives the increased damage taken conditional. And yes, you see, 
uh, Thor's uh, attack boost is Free Spirit and Slasher, but luckily Iso is Slasher, so he will still benefit from this attack boost. Swap Nami Usopp, this is important, remove the despair, but we also want to be on Usopp, so we are a shooter, because shooters will remove the damage threshold. And finally we use uh, Luffy Yamato with the ace to get an ore boost. And yeah, if you don't have a rainbow sorry hit like I do, if you do you can use Stussy after activating the super tandem, but that's a very minor optimization. I almost forget the ship. <laughs> Remove that barrier. Anyway, just hit like I do and you will be fine. Stussy and then work through the straw hats. And you see, that was before hitting with ISO, so this team is going to be amazing damage. If you can run it, I recommend it. Going to be really strong. And yeah, that's the end of the video. I'll try and make at least one new PKA team uh, per day. Uh, I got one try left today, so I'll see if I can do a batch team for tomorrow morning. But we'll see. Only one try, so no problems. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.